Morning Prayer We read The Lord reigns. The Lord is robed in majesty and armed with strength. Indeed, the world is established, firm and secure. Your throne was established long ago. You are from all eternity. Mightier than the thunder of the great waters, mightier than the breakers of the sea, the Lord on high is mighty. Your statutes, Lord, stand firm. Holiness adorns your house for endless days. We pause to quietly acknowledge the sovereignty and majesty of the Lord. We declare, the Lord is mightier than our present circumstances. We proclaim, the Lord reigns. We read, beside the rivers of Babylon, we thought about Jerusalem and we sat down and cried. We hung our small harps on the willow trees. Our enemies had brought us here as their prisoners and now they wanted us to sing and entertain them. They insulted us and shouted, Sing about Zion. Here, in a foreign land, how can we sing about the Lord? We pray. Father, we reflect on the song of the exile written by the psalmist centuries ago. And we acknowledge our own experience of exile and the consequences it brings. We feel grief when we consider what we have lost and previously taken for granted. And we confess to you that we have had an attitude of complacency towards the freedoms we have taken for granted for so long. Father, forgive us. We too wonder how we might sing the Lord's song in this foreign wilderness where the landscape is unfamiliar and the future is uncertain. Lord, we look to you to show us. Teach us a new song and how to sing it. Give us the grace to live out this season of exile in a way that honours your name. We pray these things in the name of Jesus, Lord and Saviour. Amen. We intercede. Lord of all healing, we pray for those who are sick. Father, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Sustaining Lord of all resources and provisions, we pray for those working in healthcare services. The World Health Organization, medical charities and research centers. those in financial distress and those unable to access the medical care they need. All involved in showing compassion, care and ministry in whatever form. Father, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Lord of all wisdom, we pray for our Prime Minister, and all in government. Father, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Lord of all compassion, we pray for those living in fear and anxiety for themselves and for their loved ones.
Father, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Lord of all comfort, we pray for all in exile at this time. Father, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Ever present Lord, we pray for Crowhurst Christian Healing Centre and all connected to this work. Thank you for your daily provision and we look to you, trust in you for all that we need for the future. Father, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Amen. And we pray. Lead me, Lord, lead me in thy righteousness. Make thy way plain before my face. For it is thou, Lord, thou, Lord only, that makest me dwell in safety. Amen.